Hey, did you hear the one about the Tundra, the Tacoma, and the Forerunner that walk into a bar? Yeah, I heard that one too. But I'll tell you what's not a joke. Behind me, I've got three practical legends. TRD Pro Tundra, TRD Pro Forerunner, TRD Pro Tacoma. I'm gonna compare them side by side by side to show you what I think's great about them. You tell me in the comment section what you guys think, but first, write down in the comment section where you're watching the video from. I love knowing where everybody's at in the world. Let's get started with this review. First, let me show you the front end so you can see the differences and pick which one you like better. Let's start with Tundra. LED headlights, daytime running lights, also LED fog lights, the Toyota Signature grille here. It's got Toyota Safety Sense, so it's got a radar here, a camera inside the windshield facing out for dynamic radar cruise control, lane departure alert, pre-collision system, and also automatic high beams. Then it has its hood scoop. It does not have any black labeling around it. It's color keyed. Forerunner, it's got projector beam headlights, daytime running lights, LED fog lights, the Toyota signature grill here broken up into two different parts, this black matte bumper so that that way if you go through any sticks or brush, it's not gonna mess up the nice paint job. And then it's got the hood scoop. It's got black accent right here. It does not have Toyota safety sense. Tacoma's got projector beam headlights, LED daytime running lights, LED fog lights, the black bumper here that will not scuff up your paint job, the hood scoop, it's got black decaling around it. I'll show you that in a minute. And it also, just like the Tundra, has Toyota safety sense. Here's the hood scoop on the Tacoma. The Forerunner, by the way, this is in voodoo blue, folks. And then the Tundra. Which one do you like better? Tundra, my friend Tundra here. Let's look up underneath it. You can see tow hooks. That way if you gotta pull anything. The red signature TRD skid plate here. That way it protects the valuable engine compartments underneath. Suspension, this one has the TRD Pro Fox shocks. There it is, Fox. Then Forerunner, love me some Forerunner. Has the skid plate here, red TRD logo. And then it also has TRD Pro Fox shocks. F-O-X. You know, from You've Got Mail. And then here's Tacoma underneath. I'm filming it on a different day because my camera messed up, or I messed up. There's the skid plate with red lettering. And then this one has the 2.5 inch Fox shocks suspension for optimum off-road performance. Now let's look at Tacoma from the side here. You can see the TRD Pro signature logo, 16 inch black and red alloy rims. These Predator step bars were added as an option. Side turn signal indicators. Also has blind spot monitor in it. Smart key push button start. Then we've got Forerunner here. The things you'll notice right away are the rims and the rack. <laughs> yeah, what I said. And then you can see the rack up on top. The blacked out TRD Pro logo, which looks really cool against that voodoo blue color. 17 inch TRD wheels and rims. This does not have smart key push button start, just so you know. Does not have blind spot monitor or turn signal indicator. Just doesn't. And then we've got our Tundra here. Blacked out 5.7 liter V8 engine. You can see the logo there. Blacked out door handles. TRD Pro color keyed. This has 18 inch BBS alloy rims. This one has the running boards on it, the stealth running boards. Show you that blacked out logo here. Part of the TRD charm. And then we'll look at the exhaust here. TRD on the Tundra, blacked out. Forerunner, traditional exhaust. And then Tacoma has black chrome TRD exhaust. Let's check out the back ends of this Motley crew here. 
Start with Tacoma, it has blacked out 4x4, also TRD Pro logos. And then it's got the four and seven pin wiring harness, 6,400 pound tow capacity. Backup camera. Has the composite bed with deck rail system so that you can put cleats on there and tie things down. It also has tie downs in all four corners, making it easy to move things without them rolling and rattling around. And then it's got a grounded outlet and a little storage pocket on the right side, not on the left side. Forerunner TRD Pro blacked out logo, Forerunner in chrome, 5,000 pound tow capacity. This one has the sliding rear cargo deck as an option. You can also get it with nothing there. The cargo deck pulls out, comes with the cargo tray too. It holds about 440 pounds, so you can sit on it, do workbench stuff, grounded outlet, also the 12 volt circular port. I called it the circular port one time without saying it was 12 volt and somebody skewered me, ha. And then here's Tundra TRD Pro. The towing capacity, I have completely forgotten that number. It's either 8,800 pounds or I think 9,100 pounds. I'll put it in the comment section right at the top. Four and seven pin wiring harness, blacked out four by four, color keyed insert. You can also get a blacked out insert there too. And I think that would look pretty sweet. All right. All right. And then here you could put down a bed liner or you could get a spray in bed liner. Has the deck rail system. It also has, I feel like I'm in Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory in that white room. There you go. Tacoma, under the hood, it has 278 horsepower, 265 foot-pounds of torque. It's a six-speed automatic transmission. It does come with multi-terrain select and also crawl control. Rise, rise, by yourself. Soundproofing material underneath the hood here. The engine, it's a 3.5 liter V6 engine. It has 270 horsepower, 278 foot-pounds of torque. It's five-speed automatic transmission. It's loaded with performance options. Has locking rear differential, hill start assist, multi-terrain select, and also crawl control. Tundra, Tundra here. It's got soundproofing material underneath the hood pneumatic lifts. This one's the bad boy engine of the group. It's got a 5.7 liter V8 engine, 381 horsepower, 401 foot-pounds of torque, and this one is a six-speed automatic transmission. I'm sitting in the back of the Tacoma TRD Pro, so you can see leg room, head room, shoulder room, hip room, hip bone connected to the leg bone. One of the things people wish about the Tacoma is it had a little bit more leg room in the back, and I'll show you why. This is with the seat all the way back, my knees are just about touching here. I don't have the longest legs. And then headroom, plenty of headroom here. I'm five foot eight, plenty of room here, about that much room. Seats are very comfortable in the back. And then this is the leg room with the seat a little bit more forward. There's plenty of leg room here. Yeah. Now I'm in the Tundra here. This thing is huge. It is so spacious. This is a tiny house. Anyway, lots of leg room here. Andre the Giant could sit back here. Then we've got lots of leg room here. Rear air vents, a 12 volt circular power port. And then again, lots and lots of leg room. You could sprawl out. You guys like my socks? Pretty cool. Forerunner has very good leg room. It has the second most amount of leg room behind our friend Tundra. This is not really fair though, because this is with the seat all the way forward. So if somebody was sitting there five foot, five foot two, then you'd have this much leg room, which is a ton. Rear air vents, vintage air. And then this is with this all the way back, this seat here. So there's lots of leg room, about that much. How, how many inches is that? And then lots and lots of headroom here. Like I said, I'm 5'8", and I still have plenty of headroom. This is what Tacoma looks like sitting in the back seat here. Standard moonroof. A lot of people like the layout of the Tacoma. It has nice fit and finish. It's sporty, but it's also classy. Nothing too busy. It has the Entune premium audio with navigation system. And here's the interior of Tundra.
This is the Entune Premium Audio with navigation system. Here's Forerunner's interior looking from the back seat. I'm a huge fan of the Forerunner interior. I think it's probably the most rugged out of the three. Very sporty. Very cool color scheme too for the controls and dials. There's the instrument cluster there. I think it's just got very sporty but yet relaxing colors. That'd be great for a road trip at nighttime. Namaste. Looking in the inside, there are leather seats, black seats with red stitching. One of the things people would like to see is a power mechanical driver's seat. There's the red stitching there, the detail in the leather. No memory seating. Check out all the controls. Leather wrap steering wheel. And then dual temperature controls. Has the Qi wireless charging pad down there. Automatic parking sonar. Blind spot monitor, as you can see there. And then it has the rear window that opens and closes power. Like I said, dual temperature controls and then the Entune premium audio system has JBL speakers so it has concert-like performance in your vehicle. Up top here, multi-terrain select, crawl control, locking rear differential, traction control on and off, and then your moonroof controls. And it might be nice to know that there are lighted mirrors as well. That's your Tacoma. Here's our Tundra TRD Pro. Leather seats, TRD Pro badging on the seats. It does have a power driver's seat. Tacoma's jealous. See the red stitching? I think that's so cool. Here's what the mat looks like once I have it secured properly. Blech. Check out the door. All right, so this one has a gigundo, very professional term here, a humongous storage area here with a 12 volt circular port in there, lots of cup holders. Does not have digital temperature, has the dials. And then check up top here, standard moonroof, lighted mirrors. I'm gonna show you what this car looks like from the passenger side because I wanna show you that it has the power passenger seat. These are Softex heated seats, black with red stitching, just like the others. Now let's go back. I wanna go back, go back. TRD Pro headrest, power driver seat, floor mats, leather wrap steering wheel. This lowers the window in the back, heated seats, cargo space, goes pretty deep. Four wheel drive controls here. This does not have digital temperature controls, just so you know, it has the dials. And then it has a 6.1 inch Entune audio, Entune premium audio with navigation. It also has JBL speakers, Again, so concert-like performance in your car. Now, for off-road capabilities, turn those off. This one has multi-terrain select, crawl control, active traction control, locking rear differential, traction control on and off, home link for garage door openers, holla. Has the lighted vanity mirrors with the slider and standard moonroof. My video's all over the place here. Here's Tacoma window sticker here. Tacoma TRD Pro made in San Antonio, midnight black metallic, black on black. Safety ratings, fuel mileage, 20 combined, 18 and 22. And then on the left, standard equipment that's from the factory. So feel free to pause the screen and watch that. Optional equipment that was put on at the regional port. And then this one has an MSRP sticker price of 47.5. dollars 
Window sticker for Tundra. Mm. Tundra TRD Pro Crew Max, super white with black. Made in San Antonio, deep in the heart of Texas. Great safety ratings. The gas mileage is lower than its Tacoma friend here. 14 combined. Standard equipment from the factory on left. No options were added at the factory. And then this is what was added at the regional port for options. And then this has a sticker price of 52.6, so it also has a higher price tag than the others. Here's our Forerunner window sticker. Can't leave them out. This is made in Japan. So it's 4x4 TRD Pro Voodoo Blue. Right in the middle as far as the gas mileage, combined 18. Standard equipment from the factory on the left. And then this has the sliding rear cargo deck for 350 that was added as an option at the factory. Optional equipment added. And then this one is 49.1. I'm going to give you bonus coverage. That's right. We're into extra innings. We're into overtime. I'm going to show you what each of the three vehicles looks like at night when it's starting to get lit up a little bit. It's lit. Maybe in exchange for this bonus coverage, you guys can all agree to watch a few ads all the way through without hitting skip on my channel. That's how YouTube and Google give me some love. See those headlights, projector beam, headlights, and LED fog lights. What a sharp monster this is. Remember on Tundra, this has LED headlights, daytime running lights, and fog lights. I'm telling you, that truck in white looks so badass. It's awesome. And then there's the back end. Tacoma TRD Pro. This has projector beam headlights, LED daytime running lights, and LED fog lights. What a great front end. That's my new pickup line. There you go. And then the back. And then to end this with something spooky, this is behind my dealership here. Does this remind anybody of Camp Crystal Lake? With great power comes great responsibility. Now it's your job to write in the comment section which one of those bad boys you like better, or bad girls. Tacoma, Tundra, Forerunner, write them down. Please subscribe to Toyota Jeff YouTube channel, and I will see you next time. I'm out. Toyota Jeff, subscribe today. Also, ask for Jeff if you're in the North Carolina area looking for a new car. Jeff Teague, Fred Anderson, Toyota.